Blake Boss here, folks. Today we're at Inside 3D Printing. I'm joined with Steve Heller here in New York City. And we're coming to you from the conference. There's a lot going on here. We just got out of a keynote address by Terry Wollers. If you're not familiar with him, he's uh, kind of the godfather of 3D printing. He's been around forever. He's, you know, he's the go-to man if you want to know what's going to happen in the future of 3D printing. So, Steve, we're in the conference, we were listening to him talk, he was talking about kind of the global landscape for 3D printing, so we're going to cover that, and he talked about the technology curve and obstacles, so we're going to start with the global landscape, you know, he's talking about kind of countries and who's investing the most, you know, I'm from America, I like America, how's America doing compared to some of the Asian countries well, out there? Well, actually not very good at all, the problem is America is investing collectively with a match through the American Makes Foundation, uh, $100 million with company matches. Uh, China, 240 million. Singapore, four, 400 million. Exactly, yeah. So you look at Asia. Asia is ramping up their investment. They're investing heavily in 3D printing, research and development. America is tapering back. America has a more established 3D printing uh, economy compared to these countries. Yeah, so I guess, I guess that's not very good news then, Steve. But I guess on the flip side, though, we do have some companies based here in America, like 3D Systems and Stratasys, which has operations over in Israel with their object merger. Right, that and also these companies are investing privately in their own operations to develop new technologies, to improve their service centers, to bring new materials online. So we have a more mature market, so maybe government investment doesn't need to be as high, as high to be as competitive, exactly. Because China and Singapore don't have any big name 3D printing companies. Right, they're a very small percentage of the market compared to America. America's a little bit more than a third of the market of uh, 3D printer install base worldwide.